Hi, we're gonna see how divide works on Clio. It's kind of a complex tool because it depends on the selection mode that we have that it's gonna do one kind of subdivision or another one. Okay, so let's start selecting with points. I'm gonna active hotkeys because the hotkeys for divide is D. So it's gonna be easier to, to just create uh, those divisions. For sure the command is in here in the division tab uh, divide, okay. So if we are in, in point selection and we click on D for divide, it's going to allow us to select, for example, from one point to another point of, or an edge or another point. Okay, and it's going to create the subdivision. Or we can create from a point of an edge to another one and keep clicking to create the desired subdivision. Okay. If we are in edge selection mode, we have different uh, divides here. So the first one is if uh, I have an edge selected and I click on D for divide, it's going to select this edge in two parts. Okay, so it's going to divide by half my edge. If I have uh, more selections of an edge and there are like a ring selection, okay, no matter if there are only three edges selected or the whole ring, when I click on D for divide, it's going to allow me to create this division between the three edges that we have selected and when we click it's going to create this subdivision okay when we are in faces uh, selected if we have only one face selected and we click on d it's going to allow me to choose between one direction the other one or both of them so clicking on that and validating it's going to just divide my my face in two in this case and I have multiple uh, faces selected and they are following a direction, so something like that in this case, and I click on D, it's gonna automatically divide by half my three faces selected because there, are, uh, there is a direction on my three faces selected, okay? For sure, this is the last uh, kind of divide. That is because if we are in edge mode selection, face mode selection, of, or object selection mode. And we click on divide without any pre-selection, like in this case, I, do, I don't have anything selected, so with no pre-selection. And I click on D, it's gonna allow me to active this smart divide. So it's gonna detect my the direction of, of the edge that I'm following, depend on if it's one direction or the other one and create automatically the loop of uh, the new subdivision. So just clicking on it, it's going to create this whole subdivision. If I run divide again, I can click anywhere on this edge and create another subdivision. So that's how divide works on Clio. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching.